Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Brandy here with another video. And in today's video, this is gonna be a weekly vlog. I just got done filming my self-care, affordable shower routine video. So that video is going to be out before this one, but I figured I would go ahead and show y'all some packages that I got in the mail this week. Um, just to start everything off, I got some stuff from Shein, Gymshark, and I ordered some workout shoes from Finish Line, some cute Nike. So I'm gonna show you guys those. Um, I know my lashes looking a little crazy right now it's time for a feel but that is okay and my nails but that's okay because by the end of this vlog by the end of this vlog i'm gonna be cute okay and that's all that matter okay so you just sit tight and stay tuned let me show y'all this stuff though this is one of the skims dupes shirts thingy so it's like really slinky i like it um, I got mine in a size medium because I ordered one before, a black one, and it's kind of like tight. So, I didn't want to get a small and then it'd be like, you know what I'm saying, too tight on me. So, and I am, I'm a medium anyway. Well, in some stuff because I don't really have big boobs. This is a, a padded bra, but I don't really have big boobs. So, I just get my size, but this is a medium and then i also got this color this like smoky gray color this is so freaking cute and then i got like a brown color like a chocolate a chocolate color these are really cute so and they're good quality i ordered one before like i said and then when i seen the good quality i was like i'm gonna have to order some more and they were only like seven dollars so i was like let me get some more i want to get all colors but i just got these three for now and then um i also got this cute little linen set so these are the shorts did i no they're not folded so these are the shorts and then it also came with this like crop top um button down i'm not gonna try it on on camera y'all i'm sorry gotta use your imagination but it came with this i like the color so just throw this on with some slides one day going out for brunch some cute little sandals then i also got this one which is like a ripped set i like the color very light and airy and then it comes with this shirt really cute throw this on with some jewelry running errands now i got those in medium and I guess I made a mistake, I don't know, or maybe looked small to me, so I kind of like sized up, but I did get a large in this outfit, and I tried it on, and the pants fit. The pants fit, but the shirt, I don't know if it's supposed to be this big or what, but it's like huge. This shirt is huge, so I'm like, eh. I really wasn't going for the oversized look but it's probably gonna have to be an over or tuck it in i don't know but this shirt is massive it's massive but the outfit is still cute i just wish that i had gotten it in a medium i don't know what possessed me to get a large i probably did it by mistake or looked at the picture and seeing what the model was wearing and kind of like overestimated i don't know but i'm not sending it back it was only 12 dollars, so i'm not sending it back um i probably order another one but i do not be liking to go through the hassle of sending stuff back like it just no 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 i don't really order stuff online for real anyway um but yeah i don't like to send stuff back in the mail unless it like costed a lot of money if it costed a lot of money then i'm gonna send it back but something that's 12 dollars, i'm just keeping i'm just keeping and then I got this little just regular shirt to kind of wear with some leggings or something while I'm cleaning up. Because I need more stuff like that. Just stuff, little stuff to throw on. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying, girl? I told y'all I threw all my stuff away. So I've been slowly but surely trying to play catch up. So that's what I'm doing now. Ordering like little t-shirts and stuff to just wear around the house. Now, let me show y'all my shoes. So, first, these are some crater impacts now i like these but i tried them on my feet okay like looking at them i like them you know what i'm saying i like them looking at them but i don't know how i like them on my feet like this is a size what size i think a seven yeah this is a size seven so i tried to like go up a little bit in sizing 
but then i didn't think about the fact that like they already like have this like foam bottom so it makes them look even bigger i don't know let me know what y'all think all right do we like these should i keep these i don't know i don't i might i might have to like walk around in them to kind of see but i just they I, I figured that they would feel good um just because they are the crater impact and i am absolutely obsessed with space hippies and they reminded me of space hippies so that's what i'm gonna show y'all now i did order me another pair of them but this time look i got the ones with the pink these are so freaking cute these are freaking cute look at these i got the brown ones the black ones the gray ones but these be getting sold out like it's so hard to find these like i literally was searching they were not on nike like i couldn't get them on nike no matter how many times i checked the back like they were they never had my size again so i ended up searching these and i got them from finish line and they just so happened to be on clearance so i paid like 60 dollars for these and they had my size left my size is one of the sizes they had left so i'm like you know what i'm saying it's fate i should just go ahead and purchase them so i absolutely love space hippies like if y'all have not my trainer is the one who um i seen her wearing these and she told us that they were really comfortable and to get a pair so i ended up getting my first pair and i love these freaking space hippies and they're so cute these are so freaking cute and like i got a couple of pairs so my mama tried them on one time and she's a nurse so she's like on her feet all day so my mama wore them to work and now all of a sudden she always got my shoes on i'm like girl why you got my shoes on but she said she really really like them too and she was like these are really comfortable so and my mama just like me okay i shoes can be cute all day but if they're not comfortable i'm not wearing them so like before, like they would just sit and collect dust, literally, if they're not comfortable. Because I'm on my feet all day at work too. So comfortability is something that's really important to me. But these are cute and comfortable. And then see, I messed up because they were supposed to just be for the gym. Then I started wearing them to work and they started getting dirty. <laughs> so I'm like, you know what? I need to order a pair just for the gym. So that's what I did. I'm not going to wear these nowhere but to the gym because I don't want them to get dirty like my other, all my other ones are dirty because like I was wearing them out. They just, they feel like nothing. They feel like nothing on your feet. So yeah, I really like these. If y'all haven't yet, y'all definitely need to try Space Hippies because these shoes are so freaking comfortable and they're so cute. So I got my nails done and I'm about to go in Target right now. I'm at like a super Target. Let me show y'all my nails. I tried to show y'all while I was in there, but you might not be able to see really good. But I just got white. Um, so I'm about to go in Target because tomorrow I'm going to have like a little fun day for Cali. But I'm doing this on a budget because like I told y'all and I think my last, you no, know, it was in one of my videos. Like basically i've been reading this book called get good with money and it just basically like teach you how to manage your money better so i'll be trying to be like on a strict budget and have like all my money planned out so i thought it would be fun to kind of have her like a play day and try to see if i can do it on a certain budget so i'm at target right now i'm gonna get things from like the dollar section the dollar spot at target and then i'm gonna go to dollar tree to see what i can find so she already has a splash pad so i'm gonna like hook her splash pad up and 
and just kind of have her like a little fun day in the backyard like with popsicles juice pizza music and just see what other fun summer stuff i can find she likes bubbles so hopefully i can find like something with bubbles in, that's in here that's fun she got bubble machines already so and probably hook her bubble machines up but also try to find like activities that she can do with bubbles you know like the little things that you stick into the bubble solution pick it up and like swirl it and then it makes bubbles so probably something like that and i think that's really it i do have to go grocery shopping too so i'm gonna once i leave target there is a trader joe's up the street so i'm going to trader joe's and get us some groceries for the week um because i do week over week grocery shopping now so i'm gonna go in there get us some groceries for the week and yeah that's really all i have planned i do have to clean up because my friend is coming over well two of my friends coming over and then i asked my cousin to bring my little cousin so that she can play with callie i mean she's like three years older than callie but she thinks that she's callie's mom so <laughs> so i'm like just bring her over i think it'll be really really fun so yeah, that's what I'm about to do. And hopefully this can give you guys some like ideas for the rest of the summer. If y'all have kids and y'all want to do something fun for them but on a budget. So stay tuned. I'm about to go in here now. So I just came from out of Dollar General. I was able to find some good stuff. I'll show y'all everything once I got home. Once I get home. But I only spent $25. So we are well below our budget. Thank goodness. I am about to plug up, well, hook up Callie's splash pad. She's upstairs taking a nap right now. So I'm about to um, hook up her splash pad. My friends are coming over and we're just gonna have like a little chill day or whatever. So that's what I'm about to do now. Kind of get everything ready and then I'll show y'all. It'll probably be later on tonight. Like once I'm done with everything, I have some things that I want to show y'all. But for right now, let's go ahead and get into this little fun day for my baby. Okay, y'all, I finally got this splash pad up, so now I'm about to hook the hose up to it and just kind of do like a little test run to see, but it is so huge. It's so cute, though. I, I hope she loves it. All right, y'all, so it's starting. The water's getting a little strong. At first, I thought something was wrong with it because I was like, why the water not coming out? But now I can see, I guess, the more it fills up, the stronger the pressure is to push out of like the small holes that are around it so this is what it looks like i just wanted to see i'm finna turn it off since she's still napping and get everything else ready in the house okay y'all so i put the little paper cutouts on the counter from that i got from dollar general and then i made these cute little goodie bags so these are bubbles but i made these cute goodie bags i had they got like hand clappers in there and snacks and capri suns and like bubble blower thingies so got those in there so now i'm about to go ahead and order the pizza my camera down so i gotta charge it but that's okay because kelly sleep anyway but yeah that's what i'm about to do now so i will see y'all in a minute it is currently eight o'clock and everyone has left now um today was really really fun i'm definitely gonna have to do that again callie had a lot of fun she was out there playing on the splash pad she had pizza she had snacks all day long literally pizza and snacks all day long so she was in heaven um so i'm probably gonna definitely do that again for her so i'm just i got a lot to do well not really i just gotta wash her mat for daycare get her clothes ready and then i'm going to go up there and get my stuff ready for tomorrow um so I need to take a bath. I wash clothes and stuff today, but I do need to take a bath and just kind of get my mind together. Probably read a book or something. Um, I don't know. I might hook my hookah up, but y'all know how I be feeling about that hookah. 
sometimes when I get out the tub, I be too lazy to even do the hook. I be ready to get in the bed, but as long as I get in the bed by 11, I should be fine. So that's really all I have to do for the rest of the night. I do have some stuff that I need to show y'all, some stuff that I was gifted and some new stuff that I picked up. And also, if you're not following me on Instagram, make sure you're following me on Instagram because I'm going to do like a poll, I guess, where I ask you guys like your opinions on my content or like what you guys want to see most. Um, because I feel like I can do like a lot of different stuff. So I'll definitely be on the lookout for that. And then I kind of want to do a giveaway for once I get to 10K, I'm a little ways away, but I want it to be a really good giveaway. So if you guys have any ideas or suggestions, let me know in the comments. I'm open to everything. So yeah, I definitely want to look into getting something set up for that. And then uh, the only other thing that I need to do is really get on the content posting schedule but i feel like i'll have a better idea i know for a fact i want to post either on mondays or sundays but i'll have a better idea once i do the instagram poll and see or you guys can let me know what you think in the comments here um that would be greatly appreciated oh excuse me but yeah night night um a lot is on the agenda you guys but today was a really good day my baby was super tired y'all she went right to sleep i was able to wash her hair and everything so yep it was a really good day so now i'm just about to go show y'all what i need to show y'all it'll probably be after i get out of the tub though so stay tuned so here is what i wanted to show y'all so the first is this fur body wash cleansing and balancing I just got this so I'm excited to try it out but y'all know I purchased the fur oil I showed y'all in one of my vlogs and I've been absolutely loving it like 10 out of 10 so I decided to go into Ulta and pick up the rest of what they had to offer so here are some bath drops I'm excited to use these um it says upgrade the way you bathe our signature fur oil and blend of softening oils encased in a seaweed based bath bead dissolves easily into warm water so i'm excited to try one of these self-care night i'll definitely do a video probably a tiktok but if y'all want a youtube video i definitely would do that for y'all let me know how y'all like my self-care videos well i haven't even did like a real deal self-care video for youtube yet so let me know now this is what i am most excited about so this is the fur and grown concentrate um it says healing and soothing it comes with the mid we'll open it together um what's in it well this is pretty tiny and cute hmm that's what it looks like guys it's really tiny like super tiny so got this and it says it comes with the mint <clears throat> okay this is the mint so i guess let's see what it say it says gently banish bumps and redness together this all natural oil and texture finger mitt soothe irritation and eradicate ingrowns resulting in clear smooth pores for even the most sensitive skin so hmm i'm excited to try this so i guess like you put the um the oil on wherever you're having ingrowns and then you maybe put your fingers in here i guess and massage in that area so definitely looking forward oh excuse me i keep burping definitely looking forward to trying this stuff now let me show y'all something else so this was gifted to me by a friend and here it is y'all let me tell y'all something this right here gentle fluidity if my freaking camera will focus okay gentle fluidity this freaking smells so good y'all like this is her this is it <laughs> this is it okay my favorite perfume now 
I have literally gotten like so many compliments, y'all. Like every single time I wear this, somebody be like, what do you have on? So I would definitely now, it is a bit pricey. So definitely like something that you would want to invest in or save up for a budget for whatever the case may be. Or they have like the little travel size ones that you can get. So definitely recommend, it does smell better when it's on longer in my opinion. So I absolutely love the way this smells on me. When I tell y'all compliments galore, like everybody stop me and be like, what are you wearing? Is this, this is the magic. Like people have complimented other perfumes that I've worn before, but gentle fluidity, like I just got this and literally I've been wearing it like every day and every single day, multiple people will compliment me. So definitely um, try this out if you can. I really, really love it. But yeah, that's what I wanted to show y'all. These new products that I got. I'm excited to try the first stuff out. I really, really can't wait. I will let y'all know how I like it.